Forest had never won at Pride Park going into this one, and they had Lee Camp to thank for keeping them level early on, saving from Jake Buxton. Forest were quite clearly the form team, but the Rams looked threatening from set pieces. Sean Barker this time with the effort, but Camp again foiled his former club. The visitors found their stride after the break, in particular Radislav Majewski. How about this for a mazy run to somehow create a chance for Paul Anderson? But the midfielder couldn't make the most of the opportunity. Derby goalkeeper Stephen Bywater had to be at his best to keep out Dexter Blackstock and then Anderson, as Forrest looked for the win that would put them level on points with top of the league Newcastle, even if only for a few hours. When Forrest old boy Chris Commons set up Rob Holtz for what proved to be the only goal, the celebrations were understandable, as Derby fans haven't had much to cheer about at Pride Park recently. They hadn't won at home in the championship since November. In keeping with tradition, this fixture didn't pass without a flashpoint. It arrived in stoppage time, Chris Gunter and Jay McEverly clashed, and there were plenty of teammates wanting to get involved. But no more goals, and Forrest finally get beaten on the road.